Aloha, I'm Dr. Taryn Chun, Po'okula or Headmaster for the Kamehameha School's Kapa'alama Campus. I'm honored to be this year's Young Artist of Hawaii spokesperson. As spokesperson, it's my job to help promote the Young Artists of Hawaii program to increase the number of participating schools, teachers, and students. Also, my job includes helping to make your experience in the Young Artists of Hawaii program a meaningful and engaging one. Allow me to share about this year's theme, some important dates, and the connection between reading and art. Young Artists of Hawaii is an annual student art competition and exhibition that recognizes creative excellence among Hawaii's public and private school students in grades kindergarten through seventh grade. The exhibit is presented by the Hawaii State Foundation on Culture and the Arts. The program provides opportunities for students to participate in a juried art competition with a panel of distinguished judges selecting 96 works for exhibition. This year's theme is posed as a question. What does good leadership look like? Before you get to the artistic expression of the theme, I'd like you and your classmates to discuss the qualities of good leadership, how good leaders impact our communities, and who these good leaders are in our families, in our classrooms, in our schools, in our local neighborhoods, and our global community. I've reached out to your school's librarian for help. Books related to this year's theme have been placed in a special Young Artists of Hawaii area. Please visit your school library to enjoy books related to this year's theme. What does good leadership look like? Oh, and please remember to thank your librarian for preparing this special reading area. Teachers, I invite you to begin by creating a language-rich environment around the theme. Discuss what good leadership looks like to each student. Use chart paper to transcribe students' thoughts. Read a book about a leader who made a positive impact. Discuss why communities need good leaders. Have students identify the characteristics of a good leader and who they identify as good leaders. Talk about how someone becomes a good leader and that all of us have the makings of a good leader. After you've created this language-rich environment around the theme through books and dialogue, begin the artistic process with a mood board activity using paper that is 18 inches by 24 inches. Students should use words, drawings, and magazine clippings to visually express the theme. To assist young artists, consider providing relevant stickers and pre-cut magazine clippings. This is a good place to nurture and direct individuality in expression by asking students to reflect something personal and meaningful to them a specific person or moment. Students can end the mood board activity with a show and tell, articulating their answers to the theme. To start, share your students' mood boards with their fellow young artists across our state. Please post photographs to your school's social media platforms and tag the State Foundation on Culture and the Arts and Hawaii State Art Museum. Finally, Students can be given time to produce a final composition for submission by April 1st on a piece of paper that is 18 inches by 24 inches. Please see the eligibility requirements in the program guide for submission details. I'm looking forward to enjoying your submission to this year's theme. What does good leadership look like? Join me in another video as I read aloud Surfer of the Century. It's about someone here from Hawaii who competed in the Olympics and will help us to explore this year's theme, what does good leadership look like? Aloha.